welcome back to Limon's the kitchen thank you guys for coming back to my kitchen guys in this episode we are going to prepare egg fried rice using our leftover rice so this is my leftover rice I stored in the fridge for over three weeks now so these are the ingredients I have my eggs my soy sauce my pizzelli chopped carrots bell pepper and onions so I'll uh, first of all spread my pan with some oil so we are going to fry our egg i'm going to use four eggs for this egg fried rice so after breaking the egg into a pan you will sprinkle little salt on it whisk it and fry it for about three minutes so don't fry this egg like egg frittata just or cooked one and you spread the egg so you are going to spread all this egg So we will add our chopped onions. This is our chopped onions and we are going to fry this for about one minute and add the other sliced ingredient. So after frying the egg, I will go ahead and add my sliced carrot. So I will add my carrot and fry it for some time because the carrot is very hard do not overcook all these vegetables do not overcook them do not overcook these vegetables i found out that my oil is small so i added extra butter extra butter to my vegetables so i'm going to fry this for about a minute then add the remaining ingredients so i'll add my bell pepper that is my red pepper yellow pepper and green pepper i'm going to add all of them and also stir for about two minutes do not overcook all these ingredients So I will go ahead and add my liquid Maggi cube. You can also use the normal one. This is liquid one. Yeah, so I'll sprinkle a little on it and stir it until the Maggi cube dries out. so it's time for me to add my leftover rice you can see the rice is very very strong because it was in the fridge for about three weeks now and it's very very strong i wanted to throw the rice out when i was like no let me give my fans my amazing people this recipe because you don't have to throw your leftover rice away you have to use your leftover rice for another recipe so i added my leftover rice i'm going to stir until the rice is very very strong it's very strong so i need to stir it until everything becomes soft so i'll keep stirring 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 then add my soy sauce as you stir you add your soy sauce on top of it you sprinkle a little soy sauce on it then you keep stirring you see if the color that you want i'm using the light soy sauce we have the deep one the pure black one but this is the light one because i want mine very lighter so i'm not going to use the deep or the thickened soy sauce i'm going to use the light one
so I need to sprinkle my soy sauce on top of my rice then keep stirring keep stirring keep stirring so depending on how you want the appearance of your rice that is when you're going to add the soy sauce yes so I don't want mine to appear very dark but lighter so I'm going to add little soy sauce on it and I will keep stirring and sprinkle little then my fried rice is almost ready because I have another pizzelli that's already made vegetable that one it has been cooked already so I will sprinkle the pizzelli that is my piece on it so this is my pizzelli I will sprinkle it on my rice then stir it for about two minutes then my fried rice is ready this is fried rice using leftover rice yes Thank you guys for watching to an end. God bless you. I'm going to serve my boys. So, I have to first some for my boys because they need to take their lunch. This is very simple and easy recipe. Thank you guys for watching. God bless you. See you guys on my next video. Bye-bye.